Hey, welcome back to my channel. Today we'll be making a fall vase, something similar to this one. It did not take me long to make this vase. Uh, and it was very quite simple and easy. So I'll be walking you all through, through the steps to something similar to this one. It's not going to be the same, but it's going to be something similar. So stay tuned. <laughs> Materials needed will be a hot glue gun. I have it under this plate, well, on top of this plate because it tends to drip. Um, pine cones, mini pine cones, a vase, whatever style you prefer, some fall leaves. For this vase, I'll be using this uh, centerpiece because I was like, I'm not going to do the same thing as the other one which was a sunflower i guess you can say but it's orange i don't know i don't know my flowers but yes i like the pumpkin so i was like i think i'll go with this and i like the two big leaves on the side and i thought that was pretty and then also if i'm not mistaken this is twine so yes okay to start off you will want to see how thick you like your uh twine around your base for me, I'll say about estimating about mm, an inch to a half an inch. So, no, I'm not measuring it. It's just me eyeballing it. And I don't think this is a, I think this is about an inch, if I say. Yeah, that's about an inch. Well, maybe a little over an inch. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not measuring it. I'm just doing it by eye. Take your hot glue gun. Put a dot. And then layer your twine on the glue. And then just wrap around. For me, I do not put glue around the vase. I just do it in that one spot. And then as I get closer to the beginning, then I also put more glue. But it's like another dot. It's not a lot. So, yeah. I'm just unraveling it so it's easier for me to wrap it around. So, I'll just go. And right now, I'm not worried about how it looks because I'm going to end up pushing it down if it gets too high and I don't have any room. So, as you can see, what I'm doing right now. push down as I go okay and since I need to unravel more twine I'm about to line it up oh, it <laughs> fell on the floor glue because the start of it is like very loose I'm gonna take that off that hot glue part and then add some more hot glue because and it's 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 a good thing it's on glass because it's very easy to take hot glue off glass so that being said take my hot glue good Spot. If the glue will come out, okay, there it goes. And add it. Okay, there we are. You put this one on there. So come. Okay. 
And as you can see, I'm getting closer to the top. So, well, I'm very close to the top. So with that being said, I'm gonna add some hot glue and like parts of it so it doesn't come off. And I'm gonna push those down so it's even. Put a dot of hot glue right here. Place that there and you go around. Put some more hot glue right here. There. And then go around. I do this so it does it, it's not easy for it to unravel from the top. Right. See now we're getting closer and closer. Oh, that's on top. All right, add some more because it's gonna come off. Okay, a little bit too much. Dab. Go. I got hot glue on my fingers. <laughs> okay. I'll push it down. Okay. There go. Go around. Okay, so it look like I cannot go around anymore. So with that being said, I'm gonna add some hot glue. I'll push it up a little so it's through the rim. Okay, now with my scissors, I'm gonna cut it. And there you have it. The twine around the vase. So, you'll take your pine cones. Now these last parts, they're very simple and easy because all you're doing is filling the vase with whatever you like as your decoration. Oh shoot. That has been an accident. I lost some pine cones. Place that in the center. If it's too big for me, I'll cut off the bottom. And you'll need some wire. I use wire cutters because I don't know what else to use. So, yeah, I use what I have. Let's check it now. Okay, that is fine. All right, and then you'll take your leaves. Also take the stickers off of these. Well, the tags off of them. Take your leaves. They might be okay. No, they're fine. They're perfect. Perfect length. And then place them in your desired spot or place wherever you want to place them. And just turn it. Put these in the back. Place them this way. Thing. We're gonna take the rest of your pine cones and fill out the the vase. another fall the vase very simple and easy
a different angle you can see it's very simple and easy for this